Guess what? Will Smith is officially making a comeback for I Am Legend 2, the sequel to the 2007 post-apocalyptic blockbuster. Ready for the scoop on all things I Am Legend 2? Also, let's dive into the alternate ending of the first movie, find out what goes down, and why it got the axe. Spoiler alert, the alternate ending is so good that it's setting the tone for I Am Legend 2. Stick around for more details on the sequel and, oh, did someone mention a lockdown? Let's get into it. Let's kick things off by acknowledging that after more than 15 years, Warner Brothers is finally taking steps toward the production of I Am Legend 2, the sequel to the 2007 sci-fi horror sensation. While details are still pretty scarce, it's worth noting that the original I Am Legend, featuring Will Smith and directed by Francis Lawrence, was a massive hit both critically and commercially. Based on the classic novel by the late Richard Matheson, the film stands out as a highlight in the realm of big-budget CGI blockbusters that defined 2000 cinema. It also remains one of the standout films in Will Smith's impressive filmography. Despite ongoing discussions about a potential I Am Legend 2 over the years, the success of the first film left audiences curious about what could come next. Will Smith played a pivotal role in the movie's triumph, even though his character Robert Neville met a controversial end in the climax. While initial suggestions leaned towards a prequel, the green light eventually shone on an I Am Legend sequel, with the surprising return of Will Smith, who typically avoids sequels. Although the actual release of I Am Legend 2 is still on the horizon, there are already some updates to keep the excitement alive. In May 2023, Alice Braga, known for portraying Anna in the original I Am Legend, expressed her surprise upon learning about the sequel in development. The actress, genuinely intrigued, shared, I was super surprised and very curious. I was almost jumping on the phone and saying, can I please be in it? Can I please be in it? Can I please be in it? Given Anna's significant role in the first film and her survival in both the theatrical and alternate endings, seamlessly incorporating her into I Am Legend 2 seems like a plausible move. The official confirmation came on March 4, 2022, when reports revealed that Warner Brothers had actively started working on I Am Legend 2. Adding to the positive outlook, screenwriter Akiva Goldsman is returning to craft the script. While initial plans for an I Am Legend prequel featuring Will Smith had been discussed for years after the original success, they didn't materialize. However, with the increasing frequency of I Am Legend 2 updates, the involvement of director Francis Lawrence remains uncertain. Excitingly, Will Smith is set to reprise his role as Robert Neville in I Am Legend 2, and the cast will also feature Creed star Michael B. Jordan. Although details about Jordan's character are yet to be revealed, his star power is expected to bring a fresh dynamic to the much-anticipated sequel. Considering Alice Braga's expressed interest in returning, there's a possibility she might reprise her role as Anna, contributing to the film's ensemble cast. The alternate ending of I Am Legend offers a profound and thought-provoking perspective on the infected, diverging significantly from the theatrical version. Unveiled on the DVD release of the Will Smith-led film, the alternate ending aligns more closely with Richard Matheson's original 1954 novel, adding depth and nuance to the narrative. The widespread acclaim for this alternate conclusion has influenced the upcoming I Am Legend 2, which will depart from the original ending, and Warner Brothers has made the I Am Legend alternate cut available for streaming. In the alternate ending, viewers witness a revelation about the infected that was absent in the theatrical cut. Unlike the theatrical version, the alternate ending allows Will Smith's character Robert Neville to survive. It unfolds with Neville discovering that the infected are not mindless monsters, but possess self-awareness, intelligence, and remarkably, emotions. The infected, referred to as dark seekers in the book, are shown to be terrified of Neville, revealing a more complex dynamic between him and the creatures. Crucially, the violence inflicted by the infected upon Neville is portrayed not as aggression, but as a desperate attempt to save one of their own. Neville had captured an infected female for experiments, and the assault on his home is a rescue mission to liberate her. The moral dilemma surrounding Neville's relentless quest for a cure takes center stage in the alternate ending. Realizing the intelligence, communication, and society developed by the infected, Neville allows the captured female to reunite with her kin. Though never explicitly stated, it appears that Neville comprehends the monstrous role he played in the Dark Seeker's eyes, echoing the conclusion of the original novel. This realization becomes the catalyst for survival in the alternate ending. In contrast to the theatrical cut, where Neville sacrifices himself to save survivors Anna and Ethan, the 
alternate ending sees the Dark Seekers, having achieved their mission, departing. Neville, now transformed by his newfound understanding, takes the cure and embarks on a journey to Vermont, accompanied by Anna and Ethan. The alternate ending provides a richer and morally complex conclusion to the I Am Legend narrative, prompting a reevaluation of Neville's character and the nature of humanity in the face of a post-apocalyptic world. The decision to exclude the I Am Legend alternate ending from the final cut can be attributed to several factors. While the theatrical cut underwent multiple revisions, including an early draft where Neville's dog survives, the ultimate selection of the ending was heavily influenced by audience feedback. The version in which Will Smith dies garnered the most favorable response during test screenings, leading to its conclusion in the theatrical release. However, this choice sparked controversy among fans of Richard Matheson's novel, who believed the ending failed to capture the thematic essence of the book. Despite the theatrical cut aligning more closely with the novel in terms of Robert Neville's demise, it arguably deviates from the philosophical core of a narrative centered on morally rather than traditional zombie elements. The alternate I Am Legend ending, while not a perfect adaptation of the book, hues closer in spirit, emphasizing Neville's realization of his moral ambiguity. Director Francis Lawrence revealed that negative reactions from test audiences prompted the change to a more heroic ending, casting Robert Neville as a villain in the original twist. However, with the announcement of I Am Legend 2 featuring the return of Will Smith and the introduction of Michael B. Jordan, the narrative complications stemming from Neville's death are resolved by adopting the alternate ending as canon. The sequel will follow the story from the alternate ending, showcasing Neville's survival, his escape from Manhattan with the cure, and the subsequent events. While the alternate ending clarifies how Will Smith can reprise his role in the sequel, it also introduces new questions that I Am Legend 2 must address. Did Neville administer the cure to other survivors or infected mutants? Did he decide to leave them undisturbed in the lives they established? The tension in I Am Legend 2 may stem from Neville becoming a protector for the infected against humans who failed to comprehend them. Alternatively, the movie could explore an intriguing dynamic where Will Smith takes on a villainous role, with Michael B. Jordan cast as the hero, trying to prevent him from harming the infected. The sequel holds the promise of unraveling these narrative threads while delving deeper into the morally complex and post-apocalyptic world established by I Am Legend. Thank you for tuning in to today's video. We appreciate your support, and if you enjoyed this content, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more updates. Your feedback means a lot to us, so feel free to share your thoughts and suggestions in the comment section below. Stay tuned for our next video, and until then, take care and have a fantastic day.